Hey everyone, Big Mike here. How's it going? Welcome back to Let's Play Quest 64. So when we last left off, we were uh, we had just found a pony of the horse's cottage. Of course, she wasn't really a horse. She's more like this weird turkey type thing. But anyway, she told us that we needed to go uh, into this back room and discover, uh, go to the Isle of Sky and talk to Colleen. Um, this isn't an island. There is sky, but there's if, if that's Colleen, I'm going to be a little worried for Well, you never know. Let's see, is that Colleen? No. I, where did you blow in from? It takes a plucky devil to sneak aboard my pirate ship. A magician, huh? These days the seas are strange. Waves as tall as the most, as the mass tossing ships around like corks. How are we pirates going to make a living? We heard there's a sorceress who performs water magic over on the Isle of Sky. Since you are a magician, maybe you can help us get her to the calm the sea. Welcome aboard. You can rest in a cabin till we make port. Okay, thank you, Killian's Irish Red. Um, hey, nice ship you got going on here. Hey, you even got like a first mate down here. Cool. Uh, let's see here. Uh, oh, we can save your we can save our game here if we needed to, but we don't. We because we already went to ooh, treasure box and another ship person. But we already just saved that opponent, so we should be good. Dragon's potion always nice. Hey, hey, spirits. Um, you know I think I, remember I actually had talked about uh, upping water and wind to twenty, and then the other two to thirty. But I think I'm actually gonna do a little bit of each along the way. So let's go ahead and start off with fire. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, he just being like, you're a magician. You should help us. We're pirates. We're awesome. Let's see here. See if we've magically reached our other place yet. Here we go. Um, where's the pirate guy? Hello? Mr. Pirate. Fine, I'll just let myself off. There you go. Um, let's see here. What is there? Let's see here. Let's check out the map. See where we are. Wow. Wow, map. That is so very helpful. Oh, well, this is actually this actually is helpful. Uh, let's see here. So let's just go ahead and up our earths a little bit more. Um, well, there's the little cottage. So maybe Colleen's in here or something. Any else? Anything out here amongst the the trees and the bushes? Wait. Ooh. Hey. What we? Oh, Termance, we, hey, we find you back in, uh, what you call it, back in the Windward Forest, so you guys shouldn't be too much of a hassle, but you never know, let's we'll just keep whacking at you guys and see what we, see what comes up. Hmm, so if we have enemies from, uh, Windward Forest popping back up, we might expect, um, the pumpkin heads or the, the thunder gels or, you know, a number of other type creatures. Hopefully, you know, fortunately we've been through Blue Cave since then, so hopefully our stats are a little bit better off than they were before. Wait, did I grab the thingy that was over here? Uh, no, I didn't. It's right there, even. That's okay. Uh, let's see here. So let's go ahead and up our fire and earth back up a little bit more. Here's the nice looking house. Uh, anything on the ramp? You know, we gotta check our surroundings, of course. Anything on the side? Anything in the back of the house? Oh, wait. Yes, there is one. Oh my gosh, I like all these spirits out here. They're just they're just like here. Come take us. I'm yours. Of course, if Colleen is out here, why isn't she like grabbing all these things? Uh, let's go find out. Let's see here. Um, oh, well, there's there's here's our pirate guy. Uh, it seems I have, I forgot the voice that I gave him. It seems like the leg is riled up because a priceless treasure was stolen from it. It's a fantastic gemstone filled with the power of water. What a weak sorceress she is! How can we believe the thief got to the lake bottom? Only a powerful magician could break the barrier and go that deep. I am like the sorceress of what killed her with that. Stab, you must be from like the monastery, you know. So you can't you, you you can't be a friend of this here greedy pirate, don't you know? He makes me boil every time I like see him. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
He blames me for like all the rough water, water on the lake and says it's my fault that the water jewel was stolen. But the wretch who stole it is Lindsay Lohan. No, is the one who riles the waves. They say she tossed like the water jewel from the stone circle deep into the lake. I'm afraid my magic can't like totally reach it. It's a total bummer, man. Uh, when you fight her, try to save your magic for healing. You'll need it, dude. Wow. Yeah, Colleen, I'm gonna stick with Layla. Sorry. They're probably closer to my age, but I'm going to stick with Lego. So, something about a stone circle, so I guess let's try investigating what's up this path. Um, seems pretty quiet so far. That's good. Yes? Uh-oh. Alright, who do we have? A pixie? Hmm, I guess that's like a more powerful... I totally thought I was going to whack you. A more... Okay, seriously, what is up? Ryan, what is up with you and your whacking detection? Why is that off today? You cannot have your whacking detection. Brian! My gosh! What is your what is your malfunction, Mr. Brian? Okay, here we go. So it looks like the only attack that the pixie has is the water or is the walking water. So if I can just stay far away from her, because obviously I can't whack her. She's too far or I I can only assume it's a female, but it's too the pixie's too uh, high up, so haha! Ha, I avoided your punches. Take that! Oh, owies! Wonder how much more HP she has. Of course, I could just use like ee! oh, that was close. Let's use Soul Searcher. All right, see how much HP you have. You have two hundred and thirty-one HP. Oh, and your Wind type. So actually. Yeah, there we go. That might be more effective on you. Wow, that Brian actually took a bit of a beating from that one, didn't he? Um, well, I'll just keep going upwards to see the stone pillar. Um, I've contemplating doing a little bit of grinding just in this little section here. There is one particular enemy I I, I definitely do want to show off. It, it, if if you know what it is, then don't spoil it for anybody. But uh, you know, you have to wonder, like, it's one of those times in the game where you're like, what were they on? You know, what kind of stimulants or, or you know, mind-altering drugs might they might these uh, developers have been on at the time? I don't know. Uh, maybe we, we scared them all off already. I don't know. Well, here, well, here are the Thunder Jellies. Um, no, no, don't know why my game's starting to, like, lag off or something. That's not very nice, or good. Hopefully that won't mess up my editing too much in the process, but you never know, really. Uh, let's hear steam! Yeah! Owies, owies, oxen free! For thunder jellies! Are dead. Alright, let's just try and head... I want to try and get up at least a few more HP, uh, or at least up our defense and our agility, just to weigh a couple more points. Um... I'm not sure that it's actually going to help us in our, in the next boss battle, which is obviously the the thing or whatever it was that stole the uh, water, the water stone, water jewel. Who? Yeah, here. Wow, and, and it's just grand Ga grand 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 gatch, grand gotch by itself. But yes, granitch, grand gotch is a fish with a pencil. Or a fish stick. Uh, yeah, um, zoom in if you need to, but it's a fish. It's not even like a fish kebab, it's, it's, it's just a fish. <laughs> With, out in the water, on a pencil stick. <laughs> I, you know, I mean, I gotta, I gotta appreciate them for their creativity, but... Then on the other hand, I'm just like, what? Who? How? Uh, you know, it, it kind of boggles the mind. It's a little crazy. Um, so, you know, I might, well, you know, let's just try it. Let's go. Here's the stone circle that, um, Colleen was talking about. And hey, here's another spirit up here. So let's up our fire up to 27. Mm, check around this place and go! We're down at the bottom of the sea. 
We are down at the bottom of the sea. We are down. We are down. We are down at the bottom of the sea. Uh, we are going to fight the boss who was at the bottom of the sea. And we're going to fight the boss who was living at the bottom of the sea. And there's the boss. There's the boss. There's the boss who was living at the bottom of the sea. We are going to face Mrs. Nifty. We are going to face Mrs. Nifty. We are going to face... Yeah, okay, I'm done. I don't believe it. How can a traveling little human like you get through my barrier so easily? Why have you come here? It must be to see me. I possess the water jewel. It will make me queen of the world. Humans will throw themselves at my feet and beg for mercy. Oh yes, you will too, Miss Fish Lady. So remember calling. So here's our first attempt at uh, fighting Nepti. Uh, if I remember correctly, Nepti's got about 800 HP. Obviously, she's the water type. So um, it's probably been a good thing that we've been upping our fire attacks a little bit. Um, you know. I would actually not recommend uh, using power staff in this case. Well, let's, I'll show you guys why, but ow, ow, ow. Um, it turns out that, well, I can't even reach her yet, that, that just sucks. Ow. So you know, yeah, so that very close range attack that Nepti does. Um, basically, it negates any. It seems to negate any kind of, uh, you know, status improvement that you have on yourself. So, the fact that I had attack up level two, it always goes away right as soon as she hits you with that um, upfront attack. So, in terms of a strategy for this thing, I would say try and stay as far away from her as possible, and I would say pelt her with as much fire as you can. You know, at least trying to keep a modest distance to try and get an idea on, uh, yeah, just where she's at. And of course, every time that you have a, that she's going to try and do a close range attack on you, you know, your best option is to try and get out of there, but, you know, it's not always going to work. Um, in terms of her mid-range attack, that far, like, where it's like the three little bubbles, um, I haven't really figured out a good way to avoid all three of the attacks. Um, ow. We're kind of low on health already. Um, I think we're good for one more. Well, okay. Oh boy. Yeah, okay. Definitely need to heal at this point. Um, again, we've been saving some of our items, so, you know, I, I don't feel too bad about. Uh, yeah, we've got a few. Uh,. Healing potion. So let's go ahead and use one of those for now. This is, I mean, this is obviously a much different uh, technique than we did uh, with Zels, where we just like you know got right up close and you know fought mano a mano with Zels. This it's not going to work this time, you know, if uh, based on our current stats. Um, whoa, whoa, but the, 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 yay! <laughs> Water jewel obtained. Who will say he gave the day? Yeah, it's gonna be Brian. Oh my gosh. Okay, so yeah, that was the battle with Nepti, everybody. Um, third jewel of the game obtained. Huzzah! Uh, wow, that was actually a lot faster than I was expecting it to be. I was expecting to have this to go into another part of the video, but you know what? Let's do a little bit of a celebratory dance up here on top. Go yeah, and our stats are already back up. Wow, we now have 200 HP, which is always a nice number. Um, yeah, I think we did an awesome job in that battle, everybody. So three cheers to us. Um, in terms of our spirits, uh, let's see, now that fire and rock are about 27, I'll probably up uh water and wind until about 18. You know, try and keep that three to three to two to two ratio kind of going on. But you know, I will I will meet you guys right up here in the next video. So this is Big Max saying, later.